for making good wine is to have really healthy grapes. When we do organic, we get that balance in the vineyard, and balance then translates to the winery, and I think the wines taste great. many of us now know what organic tastes like, most of us have no idea what organic actually looks and sounds like. I think I'm a better farmer because I'm organic. I have to be out in the vines, I have to be out seeing what's happening. And the more you come out and see it, the more you're in tune with the vineyard, the more that you can set the vineyard up for success. Well, what you just experienced was a small taste of that, courtesy of the industry's number one organic vineyard. The philosophy is called biodiversity, and no one does it better than the vintners from Bonterra Organic Vineyards. And Dave Cobal is from Bonterra, and he is here to tell us all about it. Welcome to the set. Welcome Thanks to the show. Thanks very much. Thank you. You know, I've been Thank waiting you. for this segment all day. <laughs> Good. That's Dave, good to hear. You, you tell, you be the change is all about initiatives that make the world a better place. Yeah. But organic farming literally makes yeah. the earth a better place. And yes. Bon Terra stands for yeah. good earth. Good earth. Exactly. How long have you been organic, and what's your story? We've been organic actually since 1987. Wow. And the story didn't start in the vineyard; it started in a garden as you can imagine, yes. an organic garden where the fruits and vegetables tasted great. And the idea is, if those fruits and vegetables can taste great, why can't we do that in the vineyard and make fabulous wine out of it? So that's how we got going. And we had to farm organically three years before we could be certified. Really? Picks three takes years. Well. And so we were certified in 1990. And then till now, it's been 26 years that's that we've amazing. been farming organically. Before it was in, before it was cool. So, you were in before it was cool. Exactly, I love that. Exactly. Well, tell me about the biodiversity dynamic way an organic farm works? Organic farming is really, it used to be just about no synthetic materials okay. in the farming inputs, right? Now it's way more than that. Mm -hmm. Organic farming, biodynamic farming, they're systems approaches. Mm -hmm. So instead of just looking at the crop plant, we look at the whole farm. So it's not only here's your grapevine, but it's Got also it. about what's happening in the soil, what's happening above the soil, and then what's happening with the grapevine, because all that biodiversity matters. You need biodiversity in your soil to have a healthy, efficient wow. soil to provide so this nutrients. this goes deep, the it pun. Does, yes. <laughs> yes. Tell us about some of the sustainability um, that the initiatives that Bonterra has really achieved mm -hmm. uh, as you began this whole process. That even goes back to one of the reasons why we went organic in the first place. Okay. Because not only is it good for the fruit, but it's also good for the people that have to work in the vineyards because each vine gets touched probably 10 times throughout the growing season. Wow. And so that's a lot of exposure. Yeah. So we felt it's safer for the people that have to work there and it's better for the environment too. So you don't have a lot of this pesticide runoff coming out of our vineyards. Yay. And for us, <laughs> you know, we're looking at everything. So we're taking care of the streams around our properties as well. So that's part of that sustainability issue, but we've been buying green power since the 1990s, hydroelectric, solar, wind, 100%. So the more you buy our wine, the more you support organic agriculture, sustainable agriculture, biodynamic agriculture. The more that you can support ha us having sheep in the vineyards. We've replaced tractors with sheep for our winter You're weeding. You're kidding. No. All right, let's, you've won so many awards. Now I get to taste some of this wine. Exactly. So let's do a little tasting here. Okay, so we're gonna start with the Bonterra Sauvignon Blanc. Okay, and love your label, by the way. Thank you Beautiful. very much. Nice screw cap on there. Perfect. Here. Okay, I'll give you that. You. All right. So that oh my gosh, that should be like nice and beautiful and fruity and crisp. Light and crisp. And I love a good Sauvignon Blanc. Love it for picnics. Love it outside. On a hot, humid day. Yes. Cold Sauvignon Blanc is great. Perfect. Okay. What's yes. next? This is really good, guys. This is what you want to try. So the, and mm. and that kind of fruit runs through all of our wines, whether it's the Chardonnay or the Cabernet or the Merlot. Wow. There's always that nice fruit component because that's why we went to organic. We wanted to showcase the fruit in the wine. Great. I'm, okay. I'm looking at this red. That looks. Like we're going so in this a little is bit Merlot. bigger glass. We got to yep. switch classes. Yep. And you decanted that. We did. So that's Merlot. We wanted it to breathe a little bit. Got it. When you open up a wine early or decant it, it allows it to oxygenate a little bit. And that'll allow some of the flavors to come out a little wow. better. Cheers. So, cheers. Well, that's so smooth. 
That's and good. I couldn't even wait to smell it. Mm -hmm. I just went right in for the taste. Yep. But it's got that nice fruit component, yes. red fruit, oh, black fruit in yeah. there. Well, you know, I wish we could just stay around here all day. And, you know, when we leave our viewers, <laughs> you and I aren't going anywhere. We're going to sure. have a little snack. Yep. You know, I want to congratulate you and the growers everywhere for doing what you're doing, for giving us this choice out there. Mm -hmm. It's fantastic. Thank you. Come back anytime you want okay. to see me. Sure. Great to have you, Dave. Very good. Thank you. All right. And for more information about Bonterra wines, just go to bonterra.com or simply log on to thebalancingact.com and don't forget to connect with us on Facebook and Twitter and at the letter B the change hashtag be e the change you can find it all over and Dave it was so great to have you here cheers thank you very much